With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The given question says that assume that assuming that x is a positive real number and a, b, c are rational numbers, show that or prove that x raised to the power b divided by x raised to the power c raised to the power a multiplied by x raised to the power c divided by x raised to the power a raised to the power b multiplied by x raised to the power a divided by x raised to the power b raised to the power c is equals to 1. This is what we are supposed to put. Now we are going to take the left hand side of this equation. So taking left hand side of the equation and prove that left hand side is equals to right hand side. So taking the left hand side, we have the left hand side as x raised to the power b divided by x raised to the power c raised to the power a multiplied by x raised to the power c divided by x raised to the power a raised to the power whole raised to the power b and here we have x raised to the power a divided by x raised to the power b the whole raised to the power c. Now I know that or we know that a raised to the power m divided by a raised to the power n is equal to a raised to the power m minus n. Don't confuse this a with this a. This is a this is the law of exponent which we are going to use to solve to simplify this equation. Now a is x and m is b and n is c here. So x raised to the power b divided by x raised to the power c can be written as x raised to the power b minus c which is raised to the power a multiplied by here also we will have x raised to the power c minus x raised to the power c minus a raised to the power b multiplied by here also we will have x raised to the power a minus b raised to the power c now on simplifying it we will get because here there is something like a raised to the power m the whole is raised to the power n so we can write this as we know that when a is raised to the power m and the whole is raised to the power n then we will have a raised to the power m multiplied by n so using this here a is x m is b minus c e, and as n is a so i can write this as x raised to the power a b minus c e, that is n multiplied by m multiplied by x raised to the power i can write this as b c minus a multiplied by x raised to the power c a minus b now on simplifying it i will get x raised to the power a b minus a c multiplied by x raised to the power b c minus a b multiplied by x raised to the power a c minus b c now we know that when the bases are same that is a raised to the power m multiplied by a raised to the power m n is equals to a raised to the power m plus n the powers are added so here bases are same so we are going to add all the powers so we will have x raised to the power a b minus a c plus b c minus a b plus a c minus b c so this will be equal to x raised to the power here if we observe a b is getting cancelled out by a b b c is getting cancelled out by minus b c a c is getting cancelled out by minus a c so we will have x raised to the power 0 and we know that when when power of a number is raised to the power 0 or power of a, of a anything is raised to the power 0 it is equal to 1 so x raised to the power 0 is equal to 1 and we know that 1 is the right hand side of the equation so what i have done is I have proven that the left hand side of the equation is equals to right hand side of the equation. So I can write that hence proved. This is what we were supposed to prove. That's all. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.